Hello and welcome to Kangaroo English. I'm Christian. I'm Billy. And today we are going to be studying reduplication. Reduplication? What's this? Well, um, today we're going to be looking at six types of reduplication. So how are you, Pili? Hi, thanks. Yeah? What is your job? What do you do? I am a teacher. Okay. And what do you teach? Uh, business administration in oh. vocational and professional studies. Oh my God, that was, <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> Absolutely perfect. <laughs> why, why do you um, study English? Why do you come to class? I like, I love uh, speak English with another people. Okay. okay. Yeah. I, I like um, to speak French, Russian, Chinese, but I only speak a little English. Okay, well, um, let's, um, let's go and study reduplication. Okay. I think, I think you'll find it very interesting. Yeah. Today we are going to learn about reduplication. Reduplication? What is this? <laughs> well, in English there are lots of different types of reduplication. Oh. Okay? So we're going to learn about all the different types. Okay. But it's something, it's very fun. Oh. Yeah, it's very fun. Okay. So the first type is rhyming reduplication. Rhyming. Rhyming? Do you know what rhyming means? Uh, rhyme. Uh, dun, dun, dun. No, this is rhythm. The rhythm. Rhyme, no. Rhyme, rhyme no. means it's the same. For example, um, dog and log. Uh, or um, peely and seely. Ah, okay. Yeah, they okay. rhyme. Yeah, 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 they rhyme. Yeah. So rhyming redu... Po poetry. Exactly, like poetry. Okay. Like poetry. Or, or music. Yeah. So rhyming reduplication, we use in English um, uh, to make it, uh, to put extra, extra emphasis. Like, for example, you could say, it's easy. It's easy. Okay, but for extra emphasis, we say it's easy peasy. It's easy peasy. Easy peasy means very easy, so it's more emphasis I, on I, easy. I'm not sure this uh, reduplication <laughs> is easy peasy. Oh, yeah, it's I easy. <laughs> also, you could say super. Super trooper. Uh, well, uh, oh. <laughs> super, almost, you could say super duper. Super duper. Do you know super trooper? Yeah, the ABBA. ABBA. Yeah, yeah. but super the duper. difference is a super trooper, the trooper, a trooper is like a soldier. Uh. So it's, super was an adjective, mm -hmm. but super duper is for extra emphasis. Yeah, very, very, very super. Very super, 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 super duper. Super, super duper. Okay, so this is the first type, rhyming. 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 The second type of reduplication is exact. Exact. Exact reduplication. And normally this is used when we talk to children or babies. Ah, okay. Yeah, it's like, it's a bit like the diminutive in Spanish. So, for example, um, well, the, a big, a normal thing for children is a wee. A wee. A wee, do you know what a wee is? We is. I, I know B, but ah. not we. We is um, to go to the toilet for a wee. Ah, okay. Yeah? Oui. So for children, you say wee oui, wee. Oui. Wee oui, wee. Oui. In Spanish, is the same. Really? Yeah, pee pee. Pee pee, yeah, exactly. Oui. Pee pee, because we. Oui. Oui, oui. So it's an exact duplication okay. for, for small, for children. Or also, so this is the first one, then you have poo poo. <laughs> <laughs> we pee poo poo. And of course. Sorry, I, I need to twi to toilet. I need to go to toilet for. <laughs> a wee wee or a poo poo? And <laughs> <laughs> Both. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, cut. Uh, and also, the most famous. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, I know it. Bye bye. bye, -bye. Exactly. Bye -bye. So, this is a, an example of exact reduplication. Okay. Okay. So, this is not, not for emphasis, this is for. Um, just for, for talking to children. And the next type is called a blout reduplication. A blout. Okay. Blout. And this is this is where we change uh, one of the vowels. Mm -hmm. Okay. We change one of the vowels, to, but we keep the consonants. Okay. Okay. So, for example, this in English. Mm. What's this called? <laughs> mm. This this pattern in Spanish zigzag. 
In, in English, the same. the same. Exactly. So you can see here, okay, we have the same consonants and we change the vowel. Zigzag. Zigzag. Or then you have this. Um, uh, similar. Like this. I don't know. This is crisscross. Crisscross. So, an example of this would be like, for example, um, the streets in New York, they crisscross. Okay. Yeah? Criss so, you see, we just changed the, we just changed the vowel in this mm -hmm. case. <laughs> then we have something very interesting, okay? This is called shm reduplication. Shm. <laughs> very good uh, sound. Thank you. Shm. Shm. Now, <laughs> now this, this, this was um, invented by um, the Jewish people living in New York. And this sound, the sh, comes from Yiddish, the language Yiddish. Um, and in this book, in this book, The Joys of Yiddish, which I recommend reading, he talks about this. Okay? So, shim. Shim. so basically, what we do is we reduplicate the word, but we put shm in front, okay? okay? It sounds very strange, so uh, I'll give you an example, okay? Teacher, shmicha. Mm. So you can see the, the consonant at the front, huh? we, we get, eliminate the consonant and we put the shm. Okay, so what this means is, okay, when we have the shm on the second part, mm -hmm. it means the first part is not good. Ah, okay. So, for example, imagine at your school you have a very bad teacher. Mm -hmm. And I say... Me. <laughs> no, no, a bad teacher. Always late, um, lazy in class, mm -hmm. the students hate her. Okay. And, and, and I ask you, I say, what does, what does she do? And you say, she's a teacher. She's a teacher, switcher. Sh Schmitcher. <laughs> she's a teacher, switcher. Teacher, schmitcher. Teacher, schmitcher. Okay, with attitude. Teacher, schmitcher, like dismiss, yeah? He's a teacher, schmitcher. <laughs> exactly, exactly, <laughs> exactly. So we use it to, to say, this is not good. Okay. okay? Mm -hmm. So, for example, um, imagine we, we go to a restaurant. And in the restaurant, there is a chef, but he's a bad chef. A chef, uh, sh chef, chef. Mm. So we eliminate the consonants. Mm. Okay. Chef. Chef schmef. Chef schmef. Schmef. <laughs> chef schmef. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Or, or, and also you can use it for objects. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like imagine your your car is very bad. I say, ah, oh, oh, I like your car, Pili. Oh, my car is a car smart. Car smart. 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 <laughs> smart. Smart. A car smart. Car smart. I have money. <laughs> <laughs> so now there are two more types of reduplication. So the first one would be comparative. Comparative reduplication. Okay, so this is to compare, mm -hmm. okay, something over the, over the period of time. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's imagine that um, in the past, and then now, imagine you go out with your friends, mm -hmm. drinking gin and tonics. Okay. Okay. So, at the start of the night in the past, mm -hmm. okay. Maybe you are sober. Sober means you have no alcohol. You are sober. Okay. Yeah? And then maybe here in the middle of the night, you're a little bit drunk. And then more drunk. Oh, more luck. Yeah? Totally drunk. And then <laughs> now. <laughs> totally drunk, right? Okay. Very drunk. Okay. Now, if we, if we want to talk about this, okay, mm -hmm. There are two, well, there are lots of ways, okay? You could, you could use a very complicated way, like you could say, um, as the night continued, 
as the night continued, um, um, Peely was getting more drunk and more drunk, or um, Peely continued to get drunk, okay? But the easy way with comparative re reduplication is we say Peely was, okay? And now we use this, so we say drunker and drunker. Ah, like this. Drunker and drunker. Drunker and drunker. So we repeat like this, always with and. Mm, and, and, and with the comparative form. Okay. The same word. The same word. Uh, drunk identical. Or, drunk. or um, let's think of another example. So let's not say drunk. Let's say. Um, an, an actress uh, who um, changed her face. Yes. More, uh, more and more younger. Good, good. So in the past, she looks young. Yeah. But then as time goes on now, she looks younger. younger. So we can say the actress is, mm. is uh, younger and younger. Very good. Oh, okay. Younger and younger. So always with the and mm -hmm. and always with the comparative. Okay. But we repeat the same word. So this is an easy way to talk about, to talk about change over time. Now, the final type, okay? And I think this is the best type, okay? This is, this is the most interesting type for, for people learning English, okay? It's called contrastive focus, contrastive focus. reduplication. <laughs> contrastive focus reduplication. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So the name, the name is very complicated, okay. right? Okay. But it's very simple. Mm -hmm. Okay. So what we do, <laughs> what we do is we repeat the word, mm -hmm. okay, with no changes, yeah. but we change the emphasis. Ah. Okay. Now um, there was a very famous um, um, academic paper about this. Okay. Mm -hmm. And the paper was called the Salad Salad Paper. In the salad, salad paper, mm. okay, the, this, the, the example was, okay, I will make I will make the tuna salad, you make the salad salad. I don't understand. So, so he says, I make the tuna salad, and you make the salad salad. So what contrastive focus reduplication does is it suggests that there are two types of a thing, okay? There's like an imitation, and then there's the real original thing. I, um, this is a real salad. No, this is the opposite. So because a salad normally is only vegetables and fruit maybe. Yeah. So if it has tuna, it's not a real salad, it's a, a, an imitation, a type of salad. Yeah. Okay? But a salad salad okay, is only lettuce, an, an authentic, a genuine salad. I understand. Yes? You, yeah. Yes? yeah, yeah. Okay. So, so and, and the technique is, the technique is that here we put extra emphasis. Okay. Salad, so salad. we could say, we could actually say better, this is in capitals, mm. the salad salad. You make the salad salad. So we're repeating the same word, okay, mm -hmm. but with extra emphasis here. Mm -hmm. So let's look at some more examples. Um. Mm. I like Scarlett, Scarlett Johansson. <laughs> but do I like Scarlett Johansson or do I like like Scarlett? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like like Scarlett, not you like like. Scarlett. Yeah, exactly. You. <laughs> so we're you. saying that this is so we're, when we when we emphasize this. You like like Scarlett. Yeah, it's not like like. I like like. I like, like, um, I forget. D David Beckham? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, George Clooney? No. Oh. The, um, Angelina. Ah, oh, Brad Pitt. 
I like like Brad Pitt. <laughs> I like like Brad Pitt. <laughs> I have a friend uh, who likes like um, real restaurants not, uh, with a um, big uh, a big uh, food, a lot of food. Oh, okay. Yeah, he said I like like. Um, I don't know. <laughs> not little food in a plate. Ah, oh, okay. So in this case, so the emphasis is not on the like. The emphasis is on the, the food. Run. So you would yeah. say, okay. so you, you would say your friend, he says, okay. I like restaurants. Okay. Restaurant, restaurant. Oh, well, no, because we want, to, we want to emphasize the food. So in this case, you would say, I like restaurants with food. With food, food. Yes, but your friend would say, I like restaurants with food food. Yeah, with so, food. as in... Not little food. Yeah, not little food, like yeah. food, food food. food. Yeah. Okay. Also, I am, I am going to put a link to a very funny um, comedian mm -hmm. talking about the difference between going out and going out-out. Okay. <laughs> so going out would be maybe going to the supermarket. Yeah. Or going to the shop. Uh, the, so yeah, the shops. Or, or going to work. Going to work. Working. And then going out-out... It's, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's very funny, to, so I'll put a link. To hit the town. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> so these are all the different types of, of reduplication in English. Reduplication. So, and, and some of these are very useful, I think. Yeah, okay. Not all. Not no. all, but some of them. Uh, poo-poo. Poo-poo, yes. <laughs> but some of them are useful, schmooseful. <laughs> <laughs> so let's, um, let's practice with a little game. So to practice this, okay, well, I am going to show you some pictures on the internet and you're going to tell me um, what you think using, using one of the types of reduplication. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the first one is this. Peely, look at my car. Oh, your car is a uh, car uh, smart. <laughs> <laughs> Not smart. But with the attitude, car smart. Kashma. <laughs> exactly. Okay. So, uh, Peely, look at this celebrity. Yeah. She's Belen Esteban. She's uh, younger and younger. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> she's younger and younger. That's perfect. So, but Peely, she's a celebrity. She's a celebrity, smelebrity. <laughs> like, shh, like, shh, smelebrity. She's a celebrity, celebrity. <laughs> Very difficult. <laughs> no, but that was good. Celebrity, celebrity, like this. Celebrity, celebrity. Okay, very good. So, is this a salad? Uh, it's a, it's a salad with uh, roast beef, I think. Good. Uh, it's a, it's not a salad, salad. Very nice. <laughs> It's not a salad salad, it's a beef salad. <laughs> Look at this person, they're, they're, they are up, they're awake. Yeah, she's uh, mm, with her phone mm. in bed. Yeah. yeah. She's up, but not up, up. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> so that, that is a, a way that you can practice some of this reduplication just by looking at photographs and practicing. So. Did you, did you think this class was easy, Pili? Uh, <laughs> I think it was easy peasy. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, it was easy peasy. It was very easy. And now you're going to speak, you know, English English, not, not just English. Yeah, English English. No, I, I, I want to speak English English and just English. Yeah, not, not just English. Not just English. Yeah, English, English. If you would like to see any more videos about grammar, pronunciation, vocabulary, etc., or if you would like to see more Peely, then don't forget to subscribe. Uh, thank you very much, Peely. Bye. <laughs> and uh, I'll see you in class. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Reduplication. Bye bye. bye, -bye. <laughs>